guys, it's Brie, and I cannot believe it's December already. Seriously, where did the month go? I've had a terrific November, and I'm so looking forward to the holidays. And I actually think I've gotten some really, really... Oh, my light's flashing. I think I've gotten some really cool things for November. Check it. I'm like... In my jammy shirt, it's really late at night, and I thought, you know what, I think I'm just going to film because I was feeling inspired, and I was really, really looking forward to my November favorites video. So I wanted to talk to you guys. I've been filming so much lately, not for YouTube. I'm sorry. I've been such a slacker. No actual movies. I worked on the movie Pitch Perfect recently. It's about an acapella show choir, and... It was a blast. Elizabeth Banks is in it, Rebel Wilson, Brittany Snow, Anna Camp, Anna Kendrick from Twilight. I was seriously, like, standing right next to Anna Kendrick the night Twilight premiered. It was incredible. I just was like, really? Is this my life? Am I really standing next to Anna Kendrick right now? Earth to Brie. No, but seriously, that really happened. And life has just been so happy and amazing, and I am... So thankful. So, so thankful. And I just, I miss all you guys on YouTube talking to you guys every single week and getting feedback. I really do. So I'm going to try to be better. I want to make you guys more a part of my life. And I'm known as the Honest Guru. This is my life and I want to share it with y'all. But on to my favorite things for the month of November. The first thing is just kind of funny. I found this at a little shop and it's called Poopery. And the principle of this product is that you just sort of put it in your guest bathroom or whatever, and before you have to poop, <laughs> you spray little squirts of it, and then it doesn't smell. And I have had, I had so many guests during Thanksgiving that I sort of just strategically placed it in all the guest bathrooms, and it really works. This stuff is awesome. <laughs> So I just I think it's a really cute idea. It says spritz the ball before you go and no one else will ever know. So if you're thinking about a fun little gift during the holidays, I think this is really cute to give as sort of a gag gift, but not really because it's awesome. And I know I said I would never ever ever buy this perfume because it's kind of lame. But I broke down and I bought it. I got Vera Wang Princess. I really do love the bottle. And I know I said I would never wear a fragrance called Princess, but it actually does smell really good. I'm going to spread some on right now so I can smell pretty for when I go to bed. I really do like it, and I think it's just a fresh, clean, out-of-the-shower kind of smell. Next, this has been my go-to eyeshadow for this month. It's from Bare Minerals, and the colors are called Breathtaking and Spectacular. This duo is called The Scenic Group. And this is actually the eyeshadow that I have on in my criminal video. I thought about doing a tutorial on this. There are the colors. And this green is seriously the most beautiful green that I own. I love, love, love this. And since my eyes are already green, I think it sort of gives a kind of snake effect. I just like it. And no matter what I try to put on during the day, if I'm wearing pink or blue, I sort of take that green and I just put it in there somewhere for that extra little pop of color. It goes with everything. I absolutely, absolutely love, love, love this eyeshadow. On to the next thing. This is just kind of funny. This is the Muppets Collection from OPI. The names of the colors are Waka Waka, Excuse Moi, Designer De Better, and warm and fuzzy. This is what it looks like. I have a red randomly rolling somewhere in my house. I have no idea where it is, but it's just a basic red. This sort of reminds me of the burlesque collection from last year, which I loved, which I lost. And I'd really like another burlesque collection. But it's they're all really sparkly except the random solid red. It's a silver, a bronze, and just a sparkle red. There you go. And they're just really sparkly, and they remind me of the holidays. I really, really love all of the colors in this. Even the solid red is just a pretty, pretty red. It sort of reminds me of the shade I'm Not Really a Waitress, which is my go-to red color. If you ever see me wearing red on my fingernails, it's I'm Not Really a Waitress. Next on my list, this is from Lush. It's called Ocean Salt for Face and Body. It is amazing. No, I take it back. It's amazing. This product... 
oh my gosh, it makes you so soft. I don't know what's in it, or, well, it says it here, so I could obviously read that, but it's, there's magic in this. Let's not even logistically go through the ingredients. There's magic in this. It makes your skin feel like silk. Not like life skin, but like you're touching on silk. It's just so cool. And I love just even keeping it beside my sink and just washing my hands and taking the tiniest, tiniest dime size. It does a mountain's worth of effort. It's incredible. This is the most incredible thing I ever use. Seriously, I just put this on all over my whole body and take a shower and then I wrap myself up in my robe and I feel like I am in heaven. I've never used anything like this before and I try all kinds of body washes and this is king. Absolute king of anything I have ever, ever, ever used. It's kind of expensive, but at the end, I think it's worth it because it is so mind-blowingly awesome. You will have the best skin. If you went over to your boyfriend's house, definitely shower with this first and he will touch your skin and just ah, be amazed. Next thing, I've mentioned this before, but it's because I love it. It is the Somewhere in Time Candle Company. Of course, I always, always want my room to smell like pralines. Someone commented on my last video and said, in Chicago, we say pralines. I don't, I don't say it like that. I say pralines. I'm from New Orleans. So I guess it's just my accent. Whatevs. I always have a candle going, and I always like praline smell, and this is my favorite candle. I'll give a picture of it. And I'll have all the info on this in the bottom bar, but it smells so good. These scents are so strong. And they have everything. There's seriously this big whole list on the website. And I will link the Somewhere in Time website and the Facebook page in the bottom bar. They're all natural products. And I guess that's why the scent lingers. And my room always smells really, really nice and fresh because of these candles. And it just draws people there. People just want to sit in my room because it smells so amazing. Oh, I love the smell. I just, I want a perfume that smells like this and then everyone will want to lick me or bite me. Mm, maybe I can attract some sexy vampire or something. I don't know. Maybe Alexander Skarsgård from True Blood. I change my foundation all the time. So this is the foundation that I've been wearing and I really think that it has improved the look of my skin. Completely. It's the Bare Minerals. I use matte and the color is medium beige. When I first started using it, I didn't think that it had the coverage that I liked, but I started using this a long time ago and they didn't have the matte. And when the matte came out, oh my gosh, I love it. I sort of steered away from it for a while, but I got back to it and I have worn nothing but Bare Minerals matte. So all my videos for the past maybe two months, that's all I'm wearing. And I've had people comment and ask me what it is. It's Bare Minerals. And it, I mean, it really does make my skin glow. I have the Bare Minerals matte on and I have the warmth. And I think I have a little bit of the Chocolate Soleil bronzer too. Last favorite thing for November is the Urban Decay 24-7 Concealer Pencil in the color FBI. This concealer is magical. Y'all know I have the worst circles and I'm always a sucker. If I want to go to buy something, it's usually concealers or eyeshadows. So this concealer, it's just, it's like a little pencil. It's typically like the little shadows that they have, the 24-7 shadows. But it works for under your eyes and it's so creamy. It's not cakey at all. But it looks like it would be. It's not. So I just put like kind of a glob and then I take my little brush and I fan it out and where I need to be and sort of concentrate on the inner corners of my eye. This is my new miracle product for under eye circles. No kidding. So I would really like to know what you guys have been buying for the month of November. I want Black Friday shopping videos, guys. I went Black Friday shopping. I spent the night outside of Best Buy, and I got my grandmother an iPad. I'm so, so horrible with the gift-giving season. I already gave it to her. I gave it to her on Thanksgiving, and I said, Don't expect anything under the tree. You have an iPad. Here you go. Enjoy. Play. Love it. And she does. And my mother got an LSU sweatshirt, so I already gave that to her. I seriously am the worst. I buy things, I let people know, I'm not good at surprises. So it's just like, here, enjoy, be happy, I can't keep secrets. Yay. That was really fun, but I didn't get to go crazy buying a bunch of things because I was trying to buy for others. I bought a really cute outfit, though. I might show you guys that next video. But thank you guys for watching. Send in video responses and rate, comment, and subscribe below. Bye!